Okay, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to my channel. I'm taking a whole nother direction today. And I'm giving the truth to a whole bunch of strangers. For the time being. We'll see. My name is Jeanette. Call me Nettie. And, um... I'm headed to the gym. To water aerobics. Which I really, really did. I'm going on vacation in August. In actually 30 days. And I've challenged myself to try to lose some weight. Three years ago, September 2019, I had um, vertical sleeve. The It's not a gastric bypass. You have two options. You have a vertical sleeve gastrectomy. I think that's what they call it, a VSG, or the bypass. I didn't get the bypass. Once I had the surgery, the doctor said, you know what? <laughs> I should have given you the bypass. Too late, doc. But anyway, and everything was relatively fine. After my surgery, I had a blood infection. I was in the hospital for a couple of weeks and then it got better. And then I was on a feeding tube and I walked around with a backpack with a pick or whatever they called it in my arm. And um, yeah, I couldn't eat any foods for a month. So I lost a lot of weight, kind of unnaturally lost a lot of weight. And I think I looked really sick. Once it was all done, started being able to eat a little bit more. Not a lot, of course. And I had gotten down to a decent weight. I had lost about 100 pounds. But fast forward, through COVID, through parents getting COVID, through my father passing, through just trying to navigate life with all of that, I put back on some. <laughs> So now, and I kept making excuses. I'm like, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to get rid of this weight. You want a little bit to fluctuate. That's natural. But um, I, uh, I got to lose some of this weight back because I don't want to get to where I was. People think that if you have, or you've heard people say that if you've had that surgery, it makes your life easier. That's the biggest lie ever told. It's the hardest thing in the world to try to eat and not gain weight back. It's no different. You just have a smaller stomach, but you can push through it. At some point, I've seen people who've had weight loss surgery get back to where they were. I've seen me. I'm not back to where I was, but I'm, I'm in three, four more years, it could happen. And the devil is a lie. It's not gonna. Before I go into uh, the health club, <laughs> I gotta go to the home good store, home repair store. I'm not spending that much. So I'm looking for painter's tape. Now I'm headed to the gym for the first time in four months or three months or two months. I'm going to try to knock it out. We'll see what happens. That's my favorite line. Okay, one day down. <laughs> I didn't beat. My legs feel like mush. Well, no, they don't. They're tired. That was rough. It wasn't rough. I've had rougher, but considering that you haven't haven't worked out in a few months, but I'm gonna try to do it every day, and I'm gonna take you guys with me. Oh no. This has got to change. Okay. It's really not as bad as it looks. I don't think it's as bad as it looks. There is a lot of stuff, but I'm going to get rid of this. Half of this is just stuff that needs to be shredded. Here's my artwork. It's not artwork. You know what I mean. Here's my little doohickeys. I like that one. I always said I wanted to do yoga. I try to remember that. 
my daughter went to San Francisco a few years ago, and I love garlic, and there was a restaurant called The Stinking Rose. Uh, today is always, today is a good day for a good day. Every day is a good day for a good day. Remember, every day you wake up is a new day to try something different. Remember that? We never went to see Van Gogh, but that's cool. News to sell. You never know who you are inspiring. I can't read that from here. I'll read it later. That's kind of rando, but I liked it. I'm getting rid of this Tiffany-style lamp. I have a hanging lamp I'm going to put there. I like that. Got it from Amazon, or as my friend says, Amazon. Don't know about those two. Everything in here is really kind of random that I got at different times, but they all seem to go together. The crab with the glasses, yeah, I can't see close up, and uh, I was born in July. This one says, look for the good, peace, good vibes. Now, we're in the month of July. It shows you the last time I was in this room. I've been working in the kitchen. That's not cool. You can go ahead and do whatever you want. I'm not sure why it's not going away. Okay. Stop casting. There we go. Okay. Got gotcha. yours. Still haven't made much of a dent in it. Because you know when you clean up, you move everything. <laughs> you move everything from one spot to another. Though... I did do a lot of shredding, so much so that, um, oh, never mind, it cooled off. Ha, ha, ha. Anyway, earlier, it had overheated. Yeah. Day two, headed to water aerobics. My plan is to go Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. I like the intense workouts because you can always slow down. <laughs> Say, oh, you know, I can't do all of that. But when they are kind of low key, because the lady is a little older and the crowd is a little older. And that doesn't mean that I'm not a little older. Whew. Okay, here I am again, leaving the gym. Just finished day two of water aerobics. My goal is to do this at least three days a week. For how long? <laughs> I don't know. I started a lot and then I quit. But my goal is to do this three days a week, at least until my cruise in August, then for my cruise in September, and then definitely for my cruise in October because that's Jonathan's birthday and we're uh, taking pictures. And I want to look better than I did in my last photo shoot. I look good, but I want to look better. Going to get some dinner. See, look at me. I follow Feisty around all the way to the side. <laughs> I don't know what I want, man. The main menu is too big. It's muy grande. <laughs> I really want the wild chinango, but I don't want it tonight. I want it. Mm -hmm. Then I want chicken, but then I know if I don't finish it all, I never like it reheated. Right. And you're not eating any meat. So, maybe I'll just get a, maybe I'll just get an enchilada. Mm.
me a water aerobics this week, and I am not in the mood. <laughs> oh, I can't show you. <laughs> <laughs> it's raining. Can you see it? Yep. Yeah. What the heck? Anyway, I'm headed to the gym. Going in the garage. Getting in the car. Oh, check this out. Even though it was almost 20 years ago, we were there. Here I go again. <laughs> oh man, I want to stay home. I committed myself to at least three days a week. So that is my intent. And here's a fun fact. I don't have much gas. I know. So, I'm living on the edge, guys. I'm living on the edge. Oh my God. Well, here I am again. Leaving the gym. This is Friday. And I'm tired. But it was good. The first couple of days this week, it was, it was good. But this one was a little more intense. And I don't like it, but I like it. Now I gotta go home and drink some water. Three days down. I didn't count how many more I have to go, but uh, it was a good workout. There's a state police car. I guess he's getting a workout in also. Now I gotta go get gas.